Hello all, I'm Ryan with Smoking Brothers. We're down here at Smoke Hollow and we're gonna be doing another cook for you with Smoker's Guide to What's for Dinner. We got the boys from Meat Whiskey up here and they're gonna be doing a skillet cornbread. Let's dive in and see what they got going on. Hey guys, Brian from MW Smokers here. Today we're gonna to do a skillet cornbread with a little twist to it. Uh, we're gonna start out with some smoked hot sausage. We just put that in a skillet on the Smoking Brothers for about 20 or 30 minutes, browned it up. Then we're gonna do some diced jalapenos, a farm fresh egg, some diced onion, a cup of flour, bacon grease, a cup of cornmeal, a can of cream corn, a cup of buttermilk, and we're gonna mix in some of this stack house rub. Uh, in addition to that, while we do this mixture, we're going to have a skillet preheating on the Smoking Brothers 425 to get started. Okay, we're going to start out this recipe very, very simple here. We're just going to add a cup of flour, then we're going to add a cup of cornmeal, then we're going to add a cup of buttermilk, a can of cream style corn, about another handful of pre-smoked hot sausage, another handful of diced jalapenos. We're gonna add our, about a handful of diced onion. If you're uh, going on a date, you might wanna back off on that a little bit. One egg. We're gonna put all that together and add about a half a cup, half a cup of bacon grease. I need some help opening this. Wayne, come on over here. I got, open that bacon grease for me while I pour. Can you, give, can you give us about a half a cup of that? There we go. Once we get that in there and mix together, we're gonna kind of sprinkle a good layer of stack house over the top of it. We're gonna mix that in the bowl. Mix it all together, consistent. Real, real consistent. Just keep on mixing and mixing and mixing and mixing. And once you get it mixed up in the bowl, if you want it a little uh, thicker or thinner, you can add a little bit more buttermilk or a little more flour or cornmeal to get it where you like it before we put it into the skillet. Once we get to our desired consistency, we're gonna head out to the Smoking Brothers P30 and we're gonna pour that batter into the hot skillet. Brian and Brian back here at Smoker's Hollow. We're about to get this cornbread on this smoker. Pull up that top for me. We put a little more bacon grease in the, in the skillet just so the cornbread wouldn't stick. That's another thing you can't ever have too much of. You wanna make sure you can hear that sizzle when you put it in there. That's just gonna prevent it from sticking to the sides. That's why you wanna use a hot skillet so that you can get that nice crust and it doesn't stick to your sides. Man, that's gonna be good. About 20, 25 minutes, it's gonna be right. All right, we're back at the Smoking Brothers. Cornbread's been on about 25 minutes. I think she's right. Let's check it. Looks about right. We're going to give it the old toothpick test. I think she's clean. Do the honors. That excess grease will soak in as it cools. Be perfect. Okay, so we're back inside with a skillet cornbread. Pretty much a done deal at this point. All we got to do is dump it and slice it. You ready? Go for it, man. All right, let's see what happens here. Look at there, it's, it's there. Mm, nice and pretty. So now it's pretty much a meal in itself. We've got all this, we've got all our fixings in there. A little crunch on the outside. All right, let's get one for the cameraman. We need to fat him up a little bit. Yeah, he's looking a little skinny these days. <laughs> you ready to try it? Always, man. Flip it, see what it looks like. Oh, that's beautiful. Man. Cheers. Sorry I didn't wait on you, man. It just looked too dang good. Mmm, understandable. That's phenomenal, man. Put Eat a little, that in your truck. Oh, put a little pulled pork over top of it, drizzle some barbecue sauce, mix it in all together. Mmm, man. There we go. Try a little meat whiskey. Uh, when all else fails, throw a little meat whiskey, guys. Mmm. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Nice finishing touch. Man, I cannot thank you guys enough for being up here. 
Really appreciate you guys taking the time out of your day to come on up and do some cooking down here at Smoke Hollow with us. We know Brandon wasn't able to join us, but he'll be up here soon. We'll get him involved. And so, like, I can't thank you guys. You guys invited me down from Memphis in May at the start of the summer, which was awesome and yeah. a spectacular event. Uh, but from our family to your family, smoked skillet cornbread is what's for dinner. Yeah. <laughs>